When I was running, I promised you would see me, you would know me, and I'd be here serving your communities. What I care about is meeting unmet needs and being sure that we are bringing the prosperity to your communities, your churches, and helping your folks that we need help. You know, today is a little bit about correcting a false narrative. And I tell you what, I have been deeply frustrated. You hear we're hard to work with. You hear all kinds of things like that. But the bottom line is, Houston's not prepared to deliver disaster recovery for Houston. And I'm gonna to defer to some of our homeowners so that you can hear some really great things about the General Land Office. I know that GLO intervened with the city of Houston had, had thrown away. I'm just happy to be in a place where I don't have to suffer, cry, or worry anymore. GLO made that happen for me. If you got a broken leg and your family member comes to try to help you, then you're gonna tell them to go away, I got this. And then a few months later, the family member comes back and you're in worse condition than where you were before you started. That's basically what they did. The city took over something they couldn't handle. The general land office, they did it in 77 days, 77 working days. I was approved with the city of Houston five years before the GLO came to my house. They've been telling me that they're coming. They've been telling me that they pull permits. They've been telling me first it was January, then it was April, then it was May, then it was June, and I just I haven't heard nothing else. A two-bedroom, a handicapped bathroom, and a third bathroom. And I want to thank you to thank y'all very much. They built my house um, in 110 days. This was a reminder from God that <laughs> your, faith, your faith can be tested, but it won't fail. And I grew up in this house, so they let you know how long this house has been built in the 50s. I have to wash dishes. <laughs> I don't have to wash dishes. I don't know how to work the dishwasher. I've never had a dishwasher. We know there's another storm coming. We know we haven't recovered from the last one. We've got to get that recovery complete, and then we have to figure out how do we come together so next time something happens, because it's gonna happen, that we come together more efficiently and more effectively.